and smash the crack pipe and put the money on the floor. But like that. But yeah, man. You, yeah. I threw it into the street, man. I, you know, and people were looking at me like I was crazy, but the Lord wouldn't allow them to see what I saw. And it just scared, man. When I tell you, he scared the living hell out of me, bro. It's, 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 it's a wrap, you know. And he told me, he said, if you ever turn around, you'll die. And it's been 15 years. But see, the fear of man is one thing. I don't fear people. You know, but the fear of God is something entirely different. Once you get into the midst of that, you know, it's just nothing. You can't debate with him. It's just a situation, you know. Yeah, man. So since then, have you, has God spoken to you again since then? Yeah. Well, yeah. Uh, he let me know. He let me know. He said, you know, there's no place for you. You can't turn around. There's nothing in this world left for you. You know, uh, that same day I was in the middle of the street. I was a block from the crack house. And uh, about 3 o'clock in the, in the p.m., and he told me if you had ever, if you had made it to the crack house, you would have died today and your soul would be in hell for eternity. So as for me, with the music that I do, you know, I try to tell people, to, I try to give them the just that it, and like you said, not to be too preachy. I don't want to force anything down anybody's throat. Yeah. And I don't get into arguing people with people about what they believe. You either believe Jesus died for your, for your sins or you don't. Yeah. But one day you'll find out. So I don't wrestle with people about that. But I do tell them that God loves us enough. You know, that he sent his only begotten son, that whosoever shall believe within him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. I tell him that straight up. But I still believe that the word says one man will, will sow a seed, another man will come along and water it, and God will bring the increase. So I don't have time to wrestle with anybody about their beliefs. But the bottom line is, you know, one day you'll find out. Exactly, man. One day they'll find out. That is right, man. But yeah, man, as a absolutely amazing amazingly powerful testimony dude and um so obviously after that man you've gone you've you know you started your life again on the right tracks and i'm glad to be speaking to you right now that, and to see that your life is back on track man like you've you know you you haven't turned back so that's that's a great thing man so no, uh, no, it's amazing so yes, sir. so tell us about respect and reverence man what are you trying to do with this with this project uh, you know when i got the name of the song when i got the name of the album God was just telling me, you know, I need people to respect the fact that I am God. I need people to reverence me for who I am, you know, and, and, and let them know I'm a loving God. I'm a merciful God. I'm a forgiving God, but I'm not the one to play with. So, you know, that's all God wants us to know. He said, I'll give you the desires of your heart. And the Lord says, it is my good pleasure to bless you, but don't play with me. You know, if you're going to be in the world, God said, I'd rather you be hot or cold. But if I find you, you know, if you're on the fence, I'll spit you out. So it's, it's best to just be real with yourself. Because you, the only way to be real with God is to be real with yourself. Be honest about the fact. Because when I was a junkie, sleeping with these different people to get money, to get high, breaking in people's houses at 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning, and I was getting high, I knew at any second in time I could die. And I, all that time I was saying, Lord, please. He knows, you have a, uh, he knows you have a problem. He knows you have an addiction. He knows you got whatever it may be, sex, drugs. You know, whatever your bondage may be, God already knows about that. But don't pimp him. Don't don't make it seem like, you know, you don't have an issue and that you got God on the back burner and everything's going to be all right until you get into trouble. Don't, don't handle him like that. You, God say, you know what I'm saying? Come all ye that are, you know, that are, that are weighed down and heavy laden and, 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 and burdened, and I'm going to give you rest. So, so my thing is, while he's available, get in where you fit in. Freedom is available through Jesus. There ain't no need for nobody to be in bondage when you can be free. Because the Bible says, when the Son sets free, it's, it's free indeed. Why would you want to stay in that mess, man? I mean, a lot of cats ain't making it out. I see young people dying every day here in Atlanta. It's, it's on the news. You can't get away from it. You just checked out the shooting down here in Florida. I mean, you never know when you're going to leave. So why wouldn't you want that insurance policy? Yeah, man, that's a, that's a good way to look at it, man. That's, a, that's something that... I was saying a while ago, like I was going to, when I was evangelizing more on the streets kind of thing and, and or trying out different ways to evangelize, that was something that I did start to say. Like I started to say, like, think of it like an insurance policy. But in the end, I said to myself, maybe that's not the best way to say it for a few different reasons. But basically, that's what it is, though. It's like, it's an, it's an insurance policy because, like, if you're not quite sure, but even if you're not quite sure, you know what I mean? It's something... <laughs> You may as well get it because if it does work, then you, you're saved. <laughs> if it if it's a load exactly. of rubbish, and it's, you know what I mean, doesn't matter, does it? Right. And then the bottom line is this: you know, um, that's a coverage you can get that won't fail because the blood of Jesus has paid for your sins. And He said, "I will." He can assure you. I assure you that if you receive Me as your Savior, you're going to be saved. So I look at it as an insurance policy. 
You understand me? But I don't see God as a thing. I see him for who he is. You know what I'm saying? My protector, my shielder, my buckler. He's like my supernatural seatbelt in the road of life. In case you run into a situation, you're covered, you know? And so with, with all due respect, and, and, and like I said, that's what the, rever- the, 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 the album is called. These songs are to get you into a place where you can see God beyond the norm, to, to recognize that you can reach out to God any day and at any given time, and you're going to be able to make a connection with him. His policy doesn't expire. You don't understand me? When, once you've been covered by the blood of Jesus, you're covered. Now, let me be very clear about something, that you can't use salvation or the blood of Jesus as a scapegoat or a free pass to do wrong or go out there and shoot up some people and say, it's okay, I'm saved, or go out and rob some folks, it's all right, I'm saved. It doesn't work like that. You, got to make a, you have to make a heartfelt, true decision to turn from wickedness and get in where you fit in, to love folks the way Jesus loves you, to turn your life over, to turn your heart over, and to turn your mind over to Jesus, you know, so that he can renew you and make you who you need to be so that we can make it into heaven. You heard me? I heard you, man. Amen to that, brother. I think, man, I think, man, we can get you on another time, man, and, and go in depth, man, because I think you got... Not only have you got a great testimony, but I think considering your testimony, you got a lot to say on it, man. I think with that, man, I think you're, I mean, we're all called to be a minister, but like some of us are called to go even further. I think you're called to go even further than a lot of people, man, because you've had that, you've, you've tasted what it, what it means, man, to like, if, if you ain't going to believe kind of thing, you've tasted it. So, ah, man, we, we definitely can go on longer, but I got to get into your music, man. Um, what do you say we play the next record? That's what's up, man. I'm loving it. Yes, sir. Yeah, this is the minister once again representing Hope Jams in the UK. I'm representing the ATL. But this next track you're about to hear is off the album, Respect and Reference, and it's called Be Careful. Y'all check me out. Young people out here that's doing dirt, that are under the false impression that they can keep on doing what they want to do, and that there's no penalty connected with their actions. Let me let you in on a little something, shawty. Hell enlarges itself every day, so watch out. Now I'ma tell it out, my Jesus said to tell it, so I'm telling you. Selling out to Satan is just something you should never do. But people often do it for the fortune and the fame. But the end of this scenario is suffering and pain. And you can be a part of this and may not even know. Cause the people that you're hanging with are really on the low. For sure, the Lord is leading me to make it clear. The people won't always turn out to be what they appear. And a lot of us are searching for a way to be accepted. But you gotta be careful of who you connect with. You don't understand something? Leave it alone. Demonic ringtones, skulls and crossbones. You bring them in your house and these spirits into your home. But this is not a battle of the flesh or the blood. It's a war over your soul from below and above. It's a sad situation because we are in the season where people see the signs but still are not believing the reason. Many of us are being deceived. It's a fact that we won't even take the time to read the word that's already been sent by the Father. But the bottom line is that we won't even bother. The proof will always be exposed by the truth. It's time for every one of us to come out of the darkness and get in position and prepare for the harvest. Be careful. People don't be deceived because most of these artists are carrying the mark of the beast. Be careful. Satan's after you. And if you ain't careful, the devil's gonna capture you. Be careful. About the way that you dance and the evidence is on your shirt to the design on your pants. Be careful. Stay away from the dog because if you don't, you turn around. You'll be taking them all Be careful Baby, this ain't a game Hell is real and I don't wanna see you burning in flames Be careful You need to open your eyes I know you know that you don't wanna go to hell when you die Be careful Take a look at your word And the Lord's gonna confirm everything that you've heard Be careful Satan's heading your way And the only thing that he wants to see is you in the grave How could a song or a video make you just lose it? The answer is that you're under the power of the music so choose it wisely and remember the lesson Or you could be a victim of a demonic possession The words say that you jump know a tree by the fruit And if you really want the truth, then you go right to the root Cause I'm tired of you when bodies at the morgue in a suit All because somebody's child got played like a fruit And the root they were supposed to be traveling was changed Now a headstone and a casket is all that remains It's a shame to see them being dumped in a grave When all they had to do was listen and they could have been saved But nowadays it's like they don't believe in death And would rather just run away so they can see for themselves If 
Just like the devil has got them dancing a daily duet They're in a trance and playing spiritual Russian roulette And you can bet he's got a million demons he can deploy against the youth They're coming, still kill and destroy To all the young folk caught up in the heaven they wait You need to shut up and listen and just learn to obey Cause one day you gon' wish you had accepted the lesson And I ain't flexing, children with respect is a blessing But if you think that you can keep on messing and transgressing Sooner or later, you gon' show get the mess. Now look out. Be careful. People don't be deceived. Cause most of these artists are carrying the mark of the beast. Be careful. Satan's after you. And if you ain't careful, the devil's gonna capture you. Be careful. About the way that you dance. And the evidence is on your shirt to the design on your pants. Be careful. Stay away from the dog. Cause if you don't, you turn around and you'll be taking them all. Be careful. Baby, this ain't a game. Hell, it's real and I don't want Burning in flames Be careful You need to open your eyes I know you know that you don't want to go to hell when you die Be careful Take a look at your word And the Lord's gonna confirm everything that you've heard Be careful Satan's heading your way And the only thing that he wants to see is you in the grave Be careful Be careful right there, featuring Luke G. That was the minister's uh, respect and reverence. These are three exclusive tracks that we're playing tonight. 